You know, feed it in the post. And just kind of climb your way, inch your way back exactly. in. Plenty of time left. Second half to come. Establish your big people. Yep. Get them opportunities in the lane. Get to the bonus. Get to the free throw line. Now you're able to organize your defense a little more effectively. Keep them out of transition. And coming up at the half, Capital One at the half. Jay and Leo Sports Center update. And AI's debut with Detroit as a new. He is at the free throw line. Well, one of the encouraging signs tonight for the Raptors has been Jermaine O'Neal playing a little bit more like the Jermaine O'Neal we've seen over the years of Son Adams going out of the game. and That's encouraging. He's doing a better job getting position, more decisive on what he wants to do, active, energetic, of his help defense. And O'Neal with 11 points. In the first game against Philadelphia in that matchup against Elton Brand, Samuel Dallenberry had 17 points, 8 rebounds, and a block shot last game. Early foul trouble, 8 points, 3 rebounds for J.O. Driving Joe Johnson. And there's O'Neal, that presence, authoring the shot. Here's Jose. He quickly looks ahead. Moving through the fingertips. Capono. Bang. Jason Capono. He needs some more sticky defense. Bibby, shot no. Who can rebound the basketball? And Capono gets it to Jose. Bibby's been incredible here in the first half. 19 points. 7-9 shooting. They're getting good shots, too. And there's front Bosch underneath in the post. He'll swing it deep in the quarter. Here's Moon. Got it. And a couple of defensive stands. And now responding. That's going into the half with a little bit of momentum. 62-50. Jimmy asks for Morris's help. Doesn't need it, gets it to Johnson. Now down to six. To five, or many of the shot clock stripped away. Moon. Collected by Morris, denied by O'Neal. One on the shot clock, and J.O. coming up big. The second block of the night. Good individual defense that time by Jamario Moon and then Jermaine O'Neal saying, Get that garbage out of here! One tick remaining with 13.9 and a timeout taken. You know, and the graphic says he's got two blocks, but he's altered three yes. others tonight as well. So O'Neal playing big. That was good individual defense that time by Jamario Moon as well. And Joe Johnson, as skilled as he is, when it's all said and done, he's going to his right hand. Sit on that. And you also combine that with the 11 points that he is producing on the offensive end. Bosch has a dozen. Capona leading the way with 14. And one tick remaining now for the Atlanta Hawks with 13.9 remaining in the first half. And the interesting dynamic when you have that one on the, on the shot clock. Could it be 1.9? It could be 1.1. You don't really know. The key is you got to make sure... You bust through screens, bang cutters, don't let people get up in the air for the lob, the alley-oop lob, and get through screens if you have to switch out quickly, do that on a quick catch and shoot. This is a key possession here as you head into halftime because if you can slow this down, stop it, possibly two or three. If you get a three, then all of a sudden, yep. it's a single-digit game going into halftime. Raptors right now on an 8-0 run. Here's Joe Johnson, and not enough time. That's a quick second. That's all right. Raptors will take it. Plenty of time here, 12.8, to get a high-end shot opportunity. And so 12.8 on the inbounds. Capono, here's Jose. And block issues as Bill Spooner heads over. And so Bill Spooner we, trying to straighten things out. Are we witnessing a clock issue here in Atlanta? I can't believe it. The Raptor fans know all about that. There's been some issues with scores and clocks and everything here. What time do you have? Oh, I got the right time of day. What do you mean? Uh, I'm talking about the clock here. <laughs> 62.50, 13 13.8 remaining here in the first half. And they change things around. Do the Hawks, Mario West on the floor, Morris, Jones, Johnson, and Williams. It's Jose along with Jamario, Bosch, Capono, and O'Neal. Here's Jose, double clutch, pops in and out. Loose ball scooped up by Joe Johnson. 
Mario West driving. 